I've been watching with high hopes Kim's Convenience, CBC's new sitcom on a Korean family with a grocery store. Reviews I saw praised it as bold, unformulaic, a classic. Judge for yourself, but the only thing I found being played as funny was their accents. So we're laughing at, not with them. Appa, come see, huh? Didn't get top fucking class. Oh, very good. We celebrate by you taking a cup. For a different take on accents, try the U.S. series Atlanta with Donald Glover from Community. The English spoken by the African-American characters is hard to make out, but it doesn't make us laugh, and it's not the only source of humor. It's simply the means of voicing the real humor. We try to understand it, not laugh at it, so we can catch everything else going on. Hey, is this milk any good? What you using it for? Drink it. Yeah, no, nah, man, I'll use it to drink. I also don't get why the parents in Kim's Convenience speak the same broken English when they're alone instead of Korean. They could use captions or even speak in perfect, unaccented English to show they're using the language they know, except those accents are the only thing the show has going for it. Is this too critical? I don't see why supporting Canadian culture means you should be uncritical as if someone will take it away if you aren't. You should be most critical about what you care most about, like public education or the CBC. You want them to be good, not just there. If they fail, you ought to double your support, not withdraw it. For the Toronto Star, I'm Rick Salute.